Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, as you guys can probably tell by the title, we are going to be doing a big thing for the Lexus. We're doing a 97 plus uh, OEM plus 97 plus upgrade kit for the SC300 today. As you guys can see, we got it all in the garage, a little piece of the kit right there. So yeah, we're going to get started on that today. This will probably be one big video. But it'll probably take me two days to do it since it's getting late now. It's like, what time is it? Almost 5 o'clock. So we got the full 97 Plus kit. I was luckily able to pick up this kit. I got it off Facebook from a guy. It's black also, so I won't even have to be painting it. No. So I got a new hood for the Lexus also. And also a new trunk. So we're going to get those also installed. Actually, the trunk, not today. I'll show you guys the trunk. But... We got the trunk also. So yeah, I got the 97 Plus kit, front bumper, side skirts, door trims, had to make sure to get those. Other side, side skirts, rear bumper. But yeah, we're gonna start with the side skirts while we still have the car on the ground so we can get them on. And I'll show you guys a little bit of the video. I'll probably do a time lapse for most of it. But I'm gonna have some before and after pictures, probably maybe before and after video. But. We're gonna have, go ahead and get started. I'll, got the SC in the garage already. So one side skirt there, and other side skirt there, rear bumper, front bumper here, and let's go right ahead. Let's get started. All right, so first things first, we're on the passenger side. Go ahead and get the door open. We're going for the door trims first which are these little, this little piece right here, door trims. So 10 millimeter, two bolts. Got that off. Pretty quick. I've done it before, so I got that off. Slide it to the side. Also, you're gonna want to make sure to get these bolts up, up off the floor, just like not how, just like I did, and just screw them back into the um, little door trim piece, just in case you need these again. All right. So next up, we're gonna open the door back up. We got two Phillips heads here, one on the other end that we're gonna go ahead and take out, and then there's clips on the bottom of this side skirt that we have to pop out. All right, so now I'm getting this off. One side, this side, the like door side is a clip, but this, there's another piece right here that's actually a bolt or bolt and nut. So we're gonna have to get part of the fender liner off, probably just the bottom part so we can reach that uh, nut behind there. Seems to be a 10 millimeter. So we lifted it and got the wheel off. So now we're gonna go ahead and All right, so we got the 10 millimeter just slightly reached in there, not really bending anything or breaking anything. And we're just twisting that off. And here it is. Exact, basically the exact same thing that is on the door trim piece, except for it's a full nut, not a closed end. All right, so we got to break out gloves because of how nasty this is. 
Look what we first pulled out. Just out of here. Whole bird nest. And there's still more in there. So, just gonna go ahead and clean it up. Might as well. All right, so this is why you wanna make sure you always clean out the cracks and stuff of your car because just from that one spot where I pulled that little dust out, we've pulled out a full bird's nest and like five pounds of dirt. Look at this. Yeah. I tried to put the dustpan there to pick up, you can't even see the bird's nest, it's buried. But I tried to put the dustpan to, you know, Help the mess a little bit, but now it's just overflowed the dustpan and gone all over the floor. But now we've got this whole area cleaned fully out and dried it off with a paper towel. And obviously took off my gloves so I can hold the camera cleanly. But yeah, now we gotta put this back on. Or not even back on, just bolt it back up. And then side skirts, we might do the other side first, but side skirts for this side should be going on. So the same deal on this side. To get this piece here out, we need to go inside to get the bolt out right here. So now we're gonna go ahead and get our 10 millimeter back and take this bolt out from the inside. So once you get this piece out, you might be wondering, since this is a nut on the front right here, it has no clip in it, and the side skirt does have a clip in there that looks kind of like this. So what I did, before even buying, before even doing the starting to install of this kit, went on Amazon and purchased a like exterior clip kit from Amazon. It's like 15 bucks. But what they have in that kit is, unless you have the actual kit from like a 97 plus, or not the actual kit, unless you have the actual clip from a 97 plus, this is just going to be a blank hole. So in this kit, they have a little clip right here, which comes with pieces like this. So you can switch this into the side skirt and go ahead and clip that in like so. Clip it in and then this will clip in there. Don't want to do it because I want to be able to put it in the side skirt, which I'm going to do right now. Go ahead and put that in the side skirt so you don't really have to just have your side skirt hanging right here. So yeah, did that on the other side already. All right, so we went ahead and cleaned up this whole um, door trim piece and the whole bottom of the door. Just not needed, but just to know that I just did it, just to know that the whole thing is going on clean. So around here on the other side, one bolt there on the end, and another one over here. See how it looks. Go ahead and close the door, hopefully. Can't close all the way. There we go. All right, so now we're here on the front bumper. Three bolts here, here, and here. Had to get them out with the drill, which takes this off. And I'm kinda, I don't know exactly what I'm doing with the front bumper, so I'm kinda just looking at the other bumper. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the bottom, I believe, next, because I don't think, I might have to take the headlights out, but I might not, so I'm gonna wait on that. But yeah, let's go ahead and go to the bottom, all right? All right, so we got the front bumper on, just mocked up right now. Uh, nothing bolted in yet, and it fits pretty good, actually. It's a little bit dirty, but there we go.
Both headlights are slipped in. I did a cleaning kit on them, uh, like the sanding and re-clear coat pretty much. Uh, this one's started bolted in, everything's plugged in. Uh, to get these headlights in, you actually have to pull out on this and push down before you bolt these two bolts right here in. So that's a little tip for you guys. And we got the hood off right now because the new hood is right over there. That's going to be going on. And yeah, kit is pretty much fully together. Except for the side skirts. But that's pretty much it for right now. A little update. I will catch you guys in a few minutes. Alright guys, so we lowered the car down and popped this side skirt on. Good, now we just gotta put the two screws in and we got it. All right guys, so we got the full kit installed. Uh, I'm gonna put some cinematics in the video for you guys so you guys can get a good look at it, a decent look. Uh, I should have a video coming up this weekend too, um, so you guys get to see it more then. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe if you are new, and I'll catch you in the next video. Thank you.